Hello everyone, I'm Iris Benajani Mizumoto, Registered Migration Agent for Bridge Auto Australia. Uh, today, we, our tip today is how to update your passport. So you've got a new passport, what do you have to do? The easiest way to do is um, uh, up, updating your details in your EME account. That's the way you will do for most visas. Uh, there are a few situations where your visa is not on an online application and you cannot import, they will won't be able to do it. But most, most visas, you can do it online. If you don't have an EME account, you might have to create one. So you need to log in into your EME account. I'm going to show you how to do that. You log it in and you're going to click in update details. And you go change of passport details. That's very easy. And you just put the new passport details, you explain the reasons why you do, and you just go next, and we, you will submit. There you go. Uh, and you, after you go that, the next screen will be to submit. I cannot do that because I'm not going to change someone's passport. Uh, if in, you were in a situation where you don't have an EME account, you might have to use the web form so you need to go to the website and there will be this web form where you can put the new passport details uh, i can click in here to show but it's a web form so you need to fill in step by step it's not different from that you're going to give the details of the old passport and the new passport and put the new passport so it's very simple very easy and it's really important to always have your passport up to date with the Department of Home Affairs. Hope you find this useful. Thank you.